I had the privilege of fighting for Vermont, the place where I was born, where I met Marcel, the place where we, where we started our family, and the place to which early in the new year we'll return together, the state of our birth. After 48 years, Senator Patrick Leahy giving his official farewell address today on the U.S. Senate floor. After parts of six decades in D.C., he's left an impression on a lot of people, including his fellow lawmakers. NBC5's John Hawks has more on this. Senator Patrick Leahy being honored on the United States Senate floor. After serving there for 48 years, after being elected as the first Democrat from the state of Vermont. But what propelled me to run was a belief that I understood the needs and values of Vermont and thought it was time for a new generation to address them. When Senator Leahy joined the Senate, there were no women in the chamber. Now there are 24. He was there as the nation faced tremendous adversity. I began my time in the Senate in the aftermath of a constitutional crisis. We faced a nation broken by the Watergate scandal, the resignation of President Nixon, and an endless war in Vietnam. Vermont's other senator thanked Leahy for his work on preserving the Green Mountain National Forest and Lake Champlain, his work on preventing dangerous foreign arms deals and other measures to save lives. Senator Leahy is known internationally for his efforts to ban the export and the use of landmines. And that, in fact, has saved the lives of God knows how many people and prevented the maiming of many, many more. Governor Phil Scott has nothing but good things to say about the senior senator. Expressing our appreciation for all he's done for our state over the last almost 50 years. The one silver lining we have is that we'll get to see more of him and Marcel back here in Vermont in the future. Other senators also giving remarks commemorating his career. Now, if you looked up the word senator in the dictionary, it wouldn't be crazy to expect a picture of Pat included alongside that name, that, that word. His name is synonymous with everything good, dignified, and admirable in the upper chamber. The longest current serving senator had a lot to say about the relationship he's built during his tenure. In the last 48 years, the Senate has become a family, both Marcel and me. Here we found friends, some of our best friends, and relationships that will last throughout our lifetime. It's also the place where I had the privilege of fighting for Vermont. In Wherever Junction, John Hawks, NBC5 News.